Have you heard about DeFi 2.0, but have no clue about what it means? <laughs> Hi, I'm Tim, and today I am going to explain to you what is DeFi 2.0. First, I want to talk to you about a new key metric we have started incorporating at ApeSwap, which is called, Return on Emissions, or RO. Basically, RO measures the value in banana which we are bringing in, versus the value we are emitting. This number is very important to our health and longevity as a protocol. Eventually our emission costs must be less expensive than our protocol's profitability and burn capabilities, increasing the row ratio to more than one. That allows us to reach true sustainability, and this is where DeFi 2.0 comes in. While DeFi 2.0 for ApeSwap is a broad, long-term initiative, we have two starting points, bonds and lending, which are meant to kickstart virtuous cycles for ApeSwap's protocol and boost row. First, regarding bonds, you might know that right now ApeSwap is renting the vast majority of the liquidity paying out high incentives to the liquidity providers. To solve this, instead of paying banana for just borrowing liquidity, we are going to actually exchange banana for owning the liquidity. This gives our DEX permanent liquidity, which will help to support larger trades and guarantee price stability. On the lending side sustainability is similar. It comes in the form of locking up supplied assets in perpetuity. This means no matter what, people will always have assets on our market to borrow. Our governance proposal is basically making this happen through creative use of fees generated. 90% will be destined to buyback banana, and 10% for ApeSwap treasury. Of the buyback amount, 55% will be locked in the ApeSwap lending network forever. So what do you say, apes? Are you ready to join us into the adventure of DeFi 2.0? Would love to hear your thoughts, questions, and concerns on our official Reddit thread, link in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, share on social media, and subscribe if you learned something, so that you don't miss the next videos.